Hey everybody, um, I wanted to give you some interesting breaking news and also a lot of you on my video last night I did talked about the 99 balloon. A lot of you uh, left the song in the comments about the, the 99 balloons in the song called, I think, Luft Balloon. And it has to do with war. And, you know, and while I was looking at it, I real I, I remembered the whole thing with those Chinese balloons, um, you know, a few months ago, interesting timing. And then uh, about a week ago, I was walking down the path right along the building here. And I saw a, a red balloon, just alone, a red balloon on the path. And I did think it was strange. Like I kind of thought, I wonder if this means anything. And then I never thought about it again. And now it's like, <laughs> okay, yeah, I think it means something. And these signs God has given us are it, it's just off the chart. I mean, there's even more that I, I don't even have time to tell you all of them. And I also wanted to remind you that, you know, the dream I had of my father telling me and who he worked in the Pentagon and there was an explosion right outside the Pentagon today. I haven't, I just saw the headline, but that's not an accident. It's didn't, it just, it didn't just happen to be near the Pentagon on their property. This is an act of war. Okay. Um, now I wanted to quickly let you hear a part of Dabu seven talking about these phones given to the satellite phones given to senators in case of a disruptive event here. Listen to this. We have confirmation here today that dozens of U.S. Senators have been issued satellite phones to be used during an emergency situation. And this situation is what they're dubbing a disruptive event. Whatever that may be, apparently our Senators are being told that something is incoming here right around the corner and that these phones that have been distributed as part of a new security effort from the Senate Sergeant at Arms have been offered to every single senator in case of a big time emergency. Okay, it's so exactly with uh, around the corner, some type of event coming around the corner. Gee, I wonder what this could be an incoming event. Guys, we know what it is. The World War III is about to break out. It's just about to break out. Uh, you know, it, 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 this is, this is, we're talking, the clock is ticking away here. It could be literally any day now. And look how it coincides with everything else. The timeline, the rap, the second coming of Christ being in 2030, subtract seven years, takes you to this year. Pentecost, the great harvest time is coming up this week. I mean, the list goes on and on of, of reasons to be expecting to, 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 to meet the Lord in the air. So anyway, I just wanted to give you this quick breaking news. Um, hopefully I'll be on later. Um, Thank you all for your happy birthdays. I really appreciate it. And, uh, and hey, you know, <laughs> one person said, wouldn't this be a great birthday week? Yeah. Yeah, I really would. And like, I've always noticed people saying over the years about the rapture, wouldn't that be a great birthday? And it's like, wouldn't that be funny if it was just a great birthday rapture week? And seriously, you know, it really could be. So, um, again, thank you everyone for all of your information that you leave in the comments, all your confirmations, uh, read the comments in the last video. If you want to be encouraged, cause they're always amazing confirmations, just off the chart confirmations all the time. God, Jesus is coming. He's coming. So, uh, anyway, I love you all and I will talk to you soon.